I'm, I'm very, very happy. You know, when they have a, a good stiff breeze like she did today, uh, you're always, it's always a concern, and um, I'm not concerned anymore. I'm very, very excited. She walked into the paddock today, and I was really, really surprised. I thought she'd be kind of a little anxious and uh, kind of, you know, kind of jumping around a little bit, uh, but she just walked in there like she trains here every day. Um, and she just went out there and was, just had a beautiful breeze with Ryan on and you know, you, you know, a guy that rides champions like that, um, for him to come off with a big smile on his face, I was, I was excited. You know, a lot, of, a lot of horses will lose a race uh, in the paddock before you even get out of the paddock. They'll you know, start getting washed out at home anyways. And uh, as soon as they get onto the track, uh, you know, fretting, going into the gate and the race, and by the time they get to the gate, they're, you know, they've, already, they've already been beaten. Uh, but this filly just is, has so much composure to her, especially and even now as a three-year-old. Um, you know, I look for, for a big, big race uh, on Tuesday. You know, a big question today was, uh, is, you know, to scope all the horses, make sure they came out with no mucus or no blood, and everything, everybody came out spot on. Uh, just finished the examinations here by the vet, and, uh, you know, hopefully this week they train on as well as they came into the, today's races, and uh, I think I'm going to have some big chances.